Hello there. Another list review. This one is a few days um, overdue. This is a list that was sent to me by Sorvix, or otherwise known as Lucretius Gal Noodle. Link to his channel in the doobly doo. Um, Sorvix and I are on the Snafu Discord together, and he sent me this list, which he had brought to uh, one of the Snafu events. And it was a doubles event. So this list is a an odd uh, number of points. And it was an attempt to make Germany great again. That worked. The two top lists at that event were German lists. So this is a really interesting uh, point and um, one that I'm very willing to look at and figure out what it is that uh, Solvix actually brought to this tournament, what worked and what didn't. Um, so let's go and look at his 640 point German list. Right. 639 points, nine order dice. That is very, very good. Having nine order dice is 640 points. That's a lot of order dice. You can see, right, that the old axiom of having um, one order dice per 100 points does not, does not keep up with reality. You should go beyond that. You should go nine order dice per 600. That is perfect. That's really good. So, so somebody has been been clever about how they've spent points here. It is a German reinforced platoon, and he is bringing a second lieutenant with an extra infantry model. Pretty clever because at that point level, you're going to need all the extra little bits and bobs that you can get, and these come equipped with assault rifles for free. That is very good. Now, the infantry here is cavalry squads, seven man cavalry squads. Um, so they're mounted on horses and I do know that he's actually spent uh, t uh, like 10 points extra, I think, um, so that it makes an even 650 uh, on mounting his lieutenant and the helper as well. Uh, that makes the lieutenant very, very survivable. So veteran cavalry, these are really good. Um, they are sort of a um, skirmish cavalry. Go and watch my video on cavalry. They're sort of skirmish cavalry. They're seven man uh, units here, but they can double up as assault cavalry if it's something that is weaker than themselves, right? Because they're veteran, they have tough fighter, they, are, they can reach quite a long way. That is pretty good. Um, so, and then a fox dome unit, inexperienced, pretty cheap. Um, they do become a little extra ex expensive compared to if you run shirkers, like Strafbat units, but they're green. They might upgrade to regulars. It's, uh, it's perfectly fine if you have the points. An LMG team? LMG teams are good for the Germans. They are worth every point. Uh, yes, they only shoot five points, but they are not, as an MMG team is fixed. So for 35 points, you get a light machine gun team that can move and shoot. That is very, very usable. Um, a good backline holder. They can even push up into the center field, skirmishing a bit. Really good. Heavy mortar, uh, inexperienced heavy mortar. It doesn't need to be a heavy mortar can be in a medium mortar, but having some sort of HE is pretty useful. Um, and he doubles up on that, having a medium house as well. So he has two three inch template indirect shots. Um, pretty good. And the medium house, it can't even shoot directly because it's regular. So it doesn't get that minus one to shoot. He's bringing a Kugelwagen as well. Mm not really needed in this list. There's nothing that I would definitely want to place in that Kubelwagen, but hey, um, you might throw in the light machine gun team or 
You might use it to transport the mortar or uh, tow the artillery. It's not really. Oh, wait a sec. I'm being dumb here. It's an armored car. Perfect. MMG 36 points. Perfect. That was me. I was being dumb. And then a Panzer 3 aus F. The Panzer III aus F is an A plus tank. It has a light anti tank gun and an MG, MMG coaxial and a whole MMG. 135 points. It is too expensive compared to the Steward with all the machine guns, but it is pretty good. Um, and, and it is a cheap A plus tank. It, it works. It does work. So, for, for less than 700 points, you get all of this. Nine order dice, including a tank that is maybe a bit too expensive, including an armored car, including two pieces of artillery, and very, very survivable infantry units, cavalry units. This is really good, Sorwix. Uh, I really like this list. There's a lot to be said for this, um, especially if you're in a meta where um, like Soviets don't get that free extra squad, all of them, or what have you. I don't know how this tournament was set up, but I think this is a really good attempt at uh, pushing in all that's good in a German reinforced platoon into this small format. So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope this was uh, informative for the guys who are maybe like figuring out how to run a small order, a small um, point value list and for us who's trying to figure out how to run Germans. Right, that was it. Have a nice day. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.